So just got my new 2023 Evo Forester 4 Plus. And as, as soon as we brought it home and went to put it in the garage, the top was scraping the garage door and the, even the, the framing here. Right here. So this video is going to be uh, me lowering just the back. It only touches back here. So you can see there's a slope. So it only touches about right there. And then it starts going down. So I'm just going to lower the, the back end maybe an inch. And I'm going to leave the front alone. So what I'm going to do is if you see the square tubing that the top is mounted to, if you follow it down, it uh, looks like it's only mounted to, by two bolts on each each side. So there's one there that's mounted to the the seat bracket, and then under this cross piece, there's another one right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove those, and then the two up here on top, and then uh, mark one inch above where these holes are. Put them one inch there and then one inch above that bottom one and that will drop everything down one inch and then reconnect. So these are just caps right here. So if you just get a thin screwdriver, you can just pop them off and it'll have a, a nylon locking nut underneath it. See, like that. So when I disconnect the framing, um, you're gonna need to support the back of the uh, roof. So I've got a, a shop room that I'm going to put under here to hold it in place. Okay, so I'm going to measure one inch from the middle of the, the existing hole and then put a mark right in the center of the tube where I want to drill a new one. Okay. Same on the other end, one inch from the middle of the old hole. Make a mark where you want it for the new hole. So this is what you'll get when you're done. I'm gonna do the same on the other uh, brace and then uh, I'll put it back on. And then when you're done, both, uh, both poles will look like this. So you gotta line up this racket down here for the seat belt and put it in the new holes that you drilled. not lining up very good and I just realized if you lift up here on the seat that bracket will line up better so just like that
All right, so once you have the two uh, uh, brackets in place and tighten down on the bottom, then we're gonna move my broom handle and just let it rest. And then we're gonna put these two bolts in here. Don't forget your spacer. So you can get space in there. Pull those and yappity dogs. Don't forget these plastic caps. 